Okay, Andrea, so the selection committee rewards Paul Hom for the gymnast that he has been, and they believe he will be again, and Jonathan Horton for being the man here at the Olympic trials. He's the one who was the best gymnast overall by score. Final thoughts, let's go to Bella Caroli and Bob Costas. Bob. All right, Al, well, Bella, Jonathan Horton and Paul Hom have been named. There are more spots to fill. Who is not sleeping well tonight? Well, definitely John and um, John Horton going to sleep very, very well along with Paul Ham. No doubt about that. But there are going to be a lot of sleepless nights for the rest of the bubble. And the first of all, and first of all, I think, you know, they're going to be not just a sleepless night, but a nightmare for Sasha Artyanev. This young man, amazing talent and an unbelievable talent. This is the best and most talented person I've ever seen in men's gymnastics for many, many years. Really? And still, and still, he did major mistakes. Well, he, and he, mistakes, fell, he fell oh, on the high bar, he oh, fell on the pommel horse, absolutely. and he stumbled on the vault. And those mistakes, mistakes brutally are penalized. So he's going to have a nightmare. I still wish he's going to be in that team because he's an asset for the team. Raj Bavsar may have played his way on. I think so. And he was solid. He was strong. And it was missing just a little bit to make it by right. The team. I think he's he going to be in it. All right, Bella, thanks very much. We will see you later tonight for the first half of the women's competition. Right, right now, back to Al. I know. Okay, Bob, Elfie, final thought? Oh, my gosh. Jonathan Horton has dreamt about being an Olympian, and more importantly, he said he wants to stand beside Paul Hom when that happens for him. Tim, go out on a limb and pick the four spots. It'll come tomorrow. <laughs> oh, God. You know, that is so hard to do. I, I believe that Morgan Hom, he is a lock at this point. That's three. I also believe that Kevin Tan is a lock. And then it gets really, really dicey. Raj, he's right there. And then you got Haggerty. And do you go with Sasha? That's the whole thing. He has the potential. Did he prove it? The one thing that I know, I am so glad I'm sitting here and I am not on that committee. And if you stay with us tonight on NBC, you can find out what the state of the art in women's gymnastics looks like in yet another showdown between Sean Johnson and Nastia Lukin. Yeah, but don't forget about Chelsea Memo. She's a name that wants to be right up with, there with those two leading Americans. Tim, a lot of people watching feel bad for Raj Babsar, should they? No, I don't think so. You know, he's really a transformed person, and he told me that regardless of what happens at these Olympic trials, this has been a dream come true for him. He is a better, stronger person at this point. Well, the Olympic trials, we started a bunch of years ago, they, they really do never disappoint, and so often the women attract all the attention and the focus, but the men are the ones that come up with these unbelievable showdowns and to listen to Raj Babsar somehow spin what happened to him four years ago into a positive for his life was unbelievable. It's un unbelievable. Your heart just goes out for this athlete, I, especially the length and time that he has spent in the sport and the positive attitude that he has taken away from, from the experience of this event. I mean, Raj has just given everything to the sport, to himself, to his family. He put on an amazing, amazing show. Tim, is this going to be a difficult process for the selection committee or not? Oh, no, it's going to be very, very difficult because they've got to look at so many different things. They also, they got to come to terms with, yes, Paul Ham, he's going to be ready or he's not going to. That changes the things uh, quite a bit. Another guy, though, I am so struck with David Durante and the performance that he had today. If he was somehow capable of doing that throughout this trials, it, I think he would have been on the team for sure. Well, that's going to do it here in Philadelphia at NBCOlympicsTomorrow.com. You can find out what the team is. Does Raj Babsar make it or not? Go to NBCOlympics.com on MSN for exclusive coverage of the U.S. Olympic trials, including video, news, and in-depth features. That and much more at NBCOlympics.com. And then tomorrow night, beginning at 7 Eastern time, the final day in the U.S. Olympic trials in women's gymnastics. Al Troutwick, Tim Daggett, Elfie Schlegel, Andrea Joyce, Bob Costas, Bella Caroli. Good night from Philadelphia.